As we last left off, the three heroes, Theron, Deg, and Wind River. What's up, guys? What's up? <laughs> they What's managed up? to burn their own cargo ship to the ground. Or it wasn't our ship. It was other guy's ship. And, he was yeah. and, it, wasn't, and it wasn't me. <laughs> you managed to kill the entire pirate crew of the ship that you are now uh, sailing. Commandeered. Commandeered. Yes. Yeah, we That's did. a pleasant way of saying murdering it's everybody else. It's all Sparrow's <laughs> fault, really. Really? Did he make it off the ship? We never established this. Yes. Uh, so Sparrow, uh, Captain Wren, and uh, a few, uh -huh. only a few other crew members uh, made it out alive. And you are now sailing towards the fortress city of Denlock. Cool. So as you guys pass the uh, the seawall there, uh, Sparrow kind of lets out a wow and like childlike wonderment as you pass under the uh, the sixty foot stone wall built across the water leading to the. Harbor. Is he leaning? Is he leaning? <laughs> is he leaning on the banister of the ship? I, Can we I rock want paper rail? scissors? Which one of us gets to slap him upside the head? <laughs> I'm down for this. <laughs> he uh, he kind of overhears your banter. It's just like. He doesn't care. He's still like, just looking up in wonderment. Uh, and as you approach the uh, the docks to uh, to Deadlock, um, you see up ahead there is a entire um, a greeting party uh, a, of guardians waiting for you. Uh, can, can I just note that we've taken down the pirate flag? <laughs> can I just <laughs> good idea? <laughs> can I just take very good note? That I have seen fit to remove that. Can I can I make note that I put some? You can you can roll a sleight of hand to check <laughs> because uh, that's the reason why you have a greeting party right now. <laughs> that's what I was thinking. So, uh, so I'm gonna be like, what pirate ship? So, so you managed to quickly take down the flag. Uh, yeah, and you guys dock at shore and um. The, uh, the Guardians greet you. Uh, they are pretty aware that you guys are not pirates, and they're just kind of tending to the wounded of your crew as uh, as you and Sparrow and Captain Wren exit the ship. Uh, you are greeted by a, a group of healers, uh, which Captain Wren just kind of brushes off. He's like, get off me, I'm fine. He's not in a good mood. Obviously. Enjoy your dysentery, asshole. <laughs> he lost his ship, uh, partly due to you guys. But I think he's forgiving. How exactly is that our one. fault? We were <laughs> in the cabin, and we were fine. And then they got attacked by pirates. We if he doesn't have pirate same. warning, exactly. We saved the lives of everyone on board. Well, not everyone. Actually, most everyone, actually, most everyone who died. made it. Everyone who made it. We saved everyone who's still alive. You're missing they the point. It, it, this oh. ship was his. It's his ship. You're less of a man without your ship. We got him a new one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but it's my ship. ship. <laughs> uh, okay, we forgot about this. Our he, ship. He waves off. Ergonomically designed. But what is a ship, really? <laughs> <laughs> Webster's Dictionary <laughs> defines a ship. A ship is a boat that carries boats. Yeah, we know we've been over this, Gary. <laughs> <laughs> uh, as you guys uh, continue your banter, uh, Captain Wren waves away the healers. He's like, "Get off me, you damn hippies! We're fine." He turns to you guys and he looks at you and says, Look, shit happens. I'm sorry about the cargo I was supposed to transport for you, but I lost my fucking shit, right? I'm not in a great mood. I'll tell you what, it's been a long day. Let me buy you a drink, I'll put you guys up for the night, and we'll figure everything out. He's gonna put up us up for the night? That wasn't English. He's gonna put okay. us River got into some of the grog on the ship, yeah, I think. Yeah, right. <laughs> I'm gonna buy everyone how except much, for that man. And stuff drink. was on that pirate ship that right. is now considered ours. Just a quick thing to mention. Yeah, did we gain any gold? We all we we leveled up in between episodes, but did we get any gold? No. No. Well. Fuck Shitty me. ass pirates. No wonder we killed them so damn easy. There was gold on the ship, but the captain is it's it's not a lot of gold. He is keeping it. He does need it. Why does he get to keep the gold? He's what the did he? What did he? Why is he the <laughs> captain of the ship? He's the captain of the ship at the bottom of the sea. I'm the captain of the ship, the pirate ship. Let's call for a mutiny. Mutiny. 
Look. Do you guys want that drink or not? Okay, let's go get drunk. Yeah, I'll get drunk, yeah. <laughs> I've been outvoted. Why didn't you start with that? <laughs> <laughs> We're so easily Cap sprayed. Captain Ren just kind of shakes his head. And he leads you into the city, towards the market district. I am a barbarian. I pillage, I plunder, I steal for myself. I kill the motherfucker who owned it. It's mine now. Laws of my people. Captain Ren just kind of ignores you as he keeps leading you through the city. <laughs> uh, he leads you through the market district. Even at night, Deadlock is bustling with corner shops, street entertainment, and citizens to spend their money. Prostitute. And Captain Ren kind of explains, this is the market district. If you need to buy a drink, supplies, you need to stay a place for the night. This is where you go. Uh, he leads you... Uh, and Sparrow's kind of tagging along behind you guys. So. Uh, <laughs> I attack guy. Captain Ren if that's the case. <laughs> I've changed my mind. I'm done with this here too. So he leads the four of you into an inn uh, with music that you can hear from a block away. He grabs a table and he orders a round of drinks for all of you. He says, look, I lost a lot of good men today. I don't have enough crew members to run a ship anymore. The three of you lost your ticket into the academy. And you... And he looks at Sparrow, and Sparrow just looks back at him with a dumb grin on his face. And you'll be fine. Okay. And you guys just stare blankly back at him. As he's just yeah. <laughs> I thought it was roaring up for his What do you there? imply, yeah. Mr. Captain? What, what should we do now? Well, don't you guys want to go to the academy? You said we lost our ticket. You did. What, what are you gonna do? Take it? I don't have the stuff I was gonna pay it with, so I suppose we need to pick up some. Let's go to the academy, find out what exactly we need now that we lost all of our shit. To be Sparrow kind of chimes in. He's like, "That's a great news. You guys can come with me tomorrow." Yeah, let's, let's do that. Let's drink like crazy go. people tonight. I, I'll order you like sixty shots right now. Yes. <laughs> Perfect. Excellent idea. We get we get Sparrow drunk. You go pick them up. <laughs> Roll a deception check. You Somebody who's got some charisma. Captain Ren kind of leans in. He's like, if you're buying this guy shots, you're paying for them. I'm sorry. I can't cover this. <laughs> I'm not very charismatic, guys. Sorry. <laughs> I'm not very charismatic. I don't feel like interacting with you people. <laughs> no, like I can't do a, a deception check. That's what I meant. Yeah. To what? To convince him to drink? Sparrow's into it. He's like, yeah, adventure is life. He just kind of downs his drink. Uh, let's do a constitution saving throw. Is he gonna die? Yeah, he's fine. Convince him to buy his own damn drinks. <laughs> he's fine. He's, he's a little tipsy. Hmm. I cast uh, Charm Person. <laughs> do you have Charm Person? Yeah. He's already pretty damn charmed by you guys. <laughs> okay. Now he's in love with you. <laughs> <laughs> Sparrow? Oh God. Why don't you, why do, why don't you buy his all shots? <laughs> wow. and beers. That's a great idea. Let's do shots. Keep them coming. Oh. All right, everybody, roll a constitution check. <laughs> he orders the strongest drink on the menu. I got a six plus. Well, what? I get a seven. So, okay, who rolled higher than a ten? I didn't hear any of that. Twelve. I Twelve? got a six plus. Is it a plus? Constitution. Whatever your constitution. Plus constitution. That's why it's a constitution. Oh, I got a ten then. There we go. Okay, so you two are fine. Wind River, you're messed up right now. <laughs> All right. All right. Okay. Let's so take, uh, we yeah. take Sparrow out and drop him in an alleyway somewhere. Mug him. And uh, we go. We go and sleep in the inn for the night. <laughs> Pick him up in the morning. He'll be fine. Okay, so the three of you, uh, you guys get to bed, and you guys, you have a rather, uh, relaxing rest. You guys, you know, you're well fed now, you're, you've had plenty of time to relax, you're well rested. Uh, but bright and early the next day, uh, you're awoken up by your favorite. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Fuck. I, <got> <laughs> beard. I thought I killed you. Left him in an alley. What does he say? <laughs> he says, come on guys, our destiny awaits. And he heads out and he waits for you guys. He's all ready but to go we, to the academy. But uh, you slept in an alleyway. Well, he's, I paid he's a man to kill him. But no, he <laughs> he was fine. 
he, he managed to get back in the end. And just fine. Not that you guys this, guy, this guy's the ultimate villain of the story, I bet. I'm not saying. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, all, of you, uh... all of you gain uh, inspiration, by the way, and you're all fully healed. Oh, cool. oh yeah, I get one inspiration. I got an inspiration dick. Yeah. Yay. Inspiration allows you to choose a uh, any role you want. You get to roll advantage on only once when you have inspiration. One you have to tell me before you roll it. <laughs> you can't just be like, oh, I fucked up. Can I just use my inspiration? Wait, what does it do? It gives you uh, it's like rolling advantage. An advantage. Yes. But you decide it before you take roll your action. Yes. Okay. Yes. Cool. Uh, and this is because you guys are well fed, well rested, etc. Okay, cool. Oh, I Wait. thought it was a, I thought it was a goof of trying to get rid of Sparrow. That was pretty amusing. <laughs> Good. If we try to use it while we already have advantage, does that add to a third roll? Or is it wasted? Uh, it would be wasted I don't think you can roll multiple advantages, so I, I wouldn't waste it on a roll that you already have advantage on. I really, really, really want to punch this guy in the schnoz. I mean, I'll let you guys do it if you want. I, cool. just, I don't see why not. To be but determined. I, I feel like it would be a waste if you already have advantage on the roll. Exactly. <laughs> anyway. All right. Okay, so well, uh, we follow shit knows. Yeah. So Jaros, uh, he uh, gingerly leads the way to the Guardians Academy campus grounds. The campus is full of other uh, wannabe adventurers, initiates, and veterans alike. Chatter fills the air as you make your way through the uh, the courtyard and to the main entrance. Jaros turns to you guys. He's like. Well, I'm headed to the registrations office, but uh, I suggest you guys go pay a visit to the dean of the school. Maybe you guys, he can help you out. Is his name Dean? Dean? Is it Dean, dean? Is it dean Martin? Mr. Dean. Dean. Martin. James but Dean. It's really funny that you asked that, Gary. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's go yeah, see. Let's, let's go. go let's right. go see Mr. Dean the Dean. Dean, Dean the Dean. Yeah. Okay, well, alright, what's okay, the actual so, name, God? So, I'm come curious. Come on, paint us a picture, what's going on? Okay, so as you step into the Dean's office, a smarmy, well-dressed man behind a cluttered desk greets you. Like, ah, welcome, initiates. So good to see some fresh new faces. Initiates. Hi, Steve. Hello, Steve. <laughs> he grins from ear to ear as he slowly scans the party, uh, letting the somewhat awkward silence after you get his name wrong. <laughs> it lingered a little too long. Uh... So, he claps his hands together. Hello, uh, I am. Hello, I am Deg. Nice to meet you, Deg. Uh, what can I do for you guys? Uh, you here to complain about the protests? Are you being bullied? You here to talk about your growing bodies? Deg, this is Steve. He's he's good people. <laughs> Th thank you, thank you, Theron. Thank you, Theron. <laughs> that, was, that, was, that was very and helpful. Dean kind of points at Theron, just kind of confused about him. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, we just need your signature on this paper. And I hand him my admittance form, I suppose. Ah, yes. Okay. You three. I heard about what happened. Terribly sorry. Especially that you didn't get to keep the boat. You guys got swindled on that one. <laughs> Could have sold that for your uh, admission fees. I tag the dean. <laughs> 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 Uh, no problems. Wouldn't want to turn down anyone with such high recommendations. Uh, look. You said that sarcastically? He... He's smarmy, so you can't really tell if he's being yeah. sarcastic or just, you know, okay. being completely sincere. <laughs> says, look, I was highly recommended by the king. Of no, course you were, Theron. No. So Dina, you. Was the being king. sarcastic no. again? <laughs> this guy over here. <laughs> All you guys need to do is prove that you really want to be here. You do that for me. How do I do that, Steve? <laughs> you just, I yeah. came here. I came here. I learned your name and I everything. Came, <laughs> I came here, Steve. He just kind of smiles at you and then continues on. Of uh, course I want to be here. I'm here. You just need to do me a small favor. Oh, let's call it an entrance exam. Dag didn't force me to come. Oh. Yes, I did. No, you didn't. You three have a very strange relationship. Where did you guys meet? On a boat. Cool. He then set it on Dark fire. Room on a boat. Wow. I didn't do that. Wow, no. that's... he did. I don't set things oh, on no, fire. It, it was the other burly elfish mm -mm. one, of course. You guys I really sound like Guardians material. I don't. I don't even I have fire worse. magic. I made it 
made it. Worse. I don't even have fire magic. I don't know how to do that. Mm -hmm. He just kind of looks at his watch, really kind of sarcastically. Uh... Yeah, it's like a sword. What, what, what time is <laughs> 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 it? You guys want to get in or not? <laughs> He's staring at his wrist awkwardly. Hit us with the favor. Hit yeah, us. what do you want? Go, Dean, Steve. Look, just do me this favor. I'll waive the registration fee. I said yes. Okay. Let's go. Man, I'm doing you guys a big favor. You could be a little more grateful than that. You were Come looking on, at Steve. your watch. <laughs> well, you guys kind of made fun of, the, I don't know what you guys Your lack of watch? Yes, because it's funny. What exactly is your quest, O Deanish one? Look, just go down to the Hunter's Guilds and talk to Ellie. Tell her I sent you. Is it a fetch quest? Something... What? Is it a fetch quest? Well, this is a fetch quest. Are we <laughs> fetching? We gotta talk to somebody. Yeah. <laughs> go talk to somebody, right? Okay. Should I work for you hooligans? So, so oh, go What are, what are we, what are we yeah, talking dude. about? <laughs> I reach my palm forward to high five Steve. <laughs> the Dean holds out a document. High five Steve! <laughs> He kind of places the document in uh, in Theron's hand. Oh. Bring that back, signed by Ellie. Okay. And you guys consider yourselves enrolled. I give him. I give him back the form. <laughs> Where'd you guys find this guy? <laughs> On a boat. Well, he know. found us. I kind of miss Sparrow. <laughs> okay. I'm just so. gonna leave this document right here, and he slides it towards you guys. I take it. I slide it back to him. I've taken it already. Oh. <laughs> he shoes you out of his office, just uh, fucking annoyed with the three of you. Okay, so the Hunter's Guild then. Let's head off to the Hunter's Guild. Let's go okay. see Alice. Ellie, I think. There you go. Oh, you guys have oh. a new thing in your inventory. Oh, oh. the document says... Do we have to read this out loud? Oh, who's who's no. holding the document? I am. Crap. Read the description. The document has been neatly rolled up and tied with string. If you open it, it appears to be a blank, except for a gold line at the bottom intended for a signature. Something seems strange about it. I oh, hand it... I have got a roll of perception. I, I hold it up to Theron. I say, you're the wizard. This seems weird and wizardy. <laughs> okay. I'm going to roll a I'm going to. I'm going to see it. It's more of an look. investigation check. I'm gonna look see. see. What are you doing? There I'm gonna I'm gonna roll to investigate. Perfect. No need to roll. Uh, your magic prowess tells you that yes, definitely there is some magic binding the contents of this document. What does it do? You could attempt to find out. Yeah. So I roll for what? Uh, roll a arcane check. Arcane. Okay. Yeah, Arcana. We'll call it Arcana. Well, that's what the game does. Uh, yeah, we'll call it Arcana. <laughs> don't. Just roll a D20, yeah. <laughs> uh, I got a 17. Ow. Plus, Plus it. Yeah, which is yeah, cool. Okay. Ah, cool. <laughs> well done. I just read the bottom part of it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. That's <laughs> Oh, that's great. I love it. <laughs> There's we one figured it out. <laughs> we are fucking detectives. So, for those of you, I will read. Here are the veteran guardians you requested. At the best the Academy has to offer. Promise, winky face. Please don't waste their time on any weird orcish rituals you people love so much. Love, Dean the Dean. Dean. De orcish rituals? Orcish rituals. Wait. I don't mean What? I, I, I don't know, and I don't like the sound of this. It's okay, okay. guys. Uh, orc, orcs are my one of my favorite enemies. So uh... Yes, so we can destroy them. But, I mean, what's an orcish ritual? What do orcs do? I mean, they like to dance around in the woods naked, but I don't know what that's to do with anything. Oh, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> so to the Hunter's Guild. I suppose we might as well head off to the Hunter's Guild. Wait, is there any shops? There is, at the Market District. Yeah, but we don't have much money, do we? Can we check it out anyway? Yeah. Fine. I want to see the markets. Let's go to the market. Yay! Oh, this is cool. I like this. 
Oh, you have SBs and shit too. Is it an armor or what? Well, there's you can move them. Uh oh. Oh, excellent. So at the market, yeah, you'll find the armorer and the weaponsmith, and uh, also there's uh, there's various item shops. Pretty much anything you guys are looking for, you can find. It's just I did not take the time to make a list of all the other items. But healing potions, Wait. I think, that are sold at other markets. I'm gonna say one thing. Yes. Mm. This all seems really cheap. It's not. How much gold do you have? I've got 150 gold. If I buy studded leather armor right now, I get plus 12 to my deck. No. No. You get 12. Uh, your plus AC your dex. is 12 plus your dex. AC is 12 plus my dex. So yes. I'd have 14 AC. As opposed to. Mm -hmm. Okay, AC 12. Is okay. I get it. Now I get it. It's okay. And what's that disadvantage? Oh, it's no. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. But, cool. uh, yeah. Are there any, uh. Uh, arrows? What do you mean? Like arrows to buy for my quiver. Oh yes, uh, I did not list them here, mm. but I can look that up for you. Real quick. Do you have any hiding behind the counter, like uh, special special? Yeah, I got arrows. How many arrows do you want? I don't know. How many can fit in a quiver? Let me see that quiver, bro. All right, look at this quiver. It's pretty big. How many arrows did you like, use? Uh, have you even been keeping track? I used three. <laughs> use three. Shot arrows, yeah. So I only have 27 left. I started with okay. Me. So we'll assume your quiver can hold 30 arrows. Do you want to buy three arrows? <laughs> yes, I'm gonna use them all. You know what? Awesome works. I like the cut of your jib on the house. Three Sweet. arrows. Here you go. All right. The really cool. shitty looking arrows. Whatever. <laughs> Still pierce your face with it. Okay. Is it an is it an uh, item shop? Yeah, like, if you guys need health potions, etc. Yes. I'm good, I still have my one. Gary, you should probably buy one. Yeah, do you have, do you have a table for that, PJ? Or? I do, unfortunately for that, I do have to look it up. Uh, potion of healing, wow! That's insane. <laughs> How much? 50 gold pieces. 50? <laughs> okay, I'm gonna buy one. Maybe you gonna try to haggle? <laughs> oh, yeah. He has a negative Close. charisma. This is not. Yeah, no, it was, it was oh, a yeah. Joke. I'll give you more money. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh. Okay, I'm down to a hundred gold. Cool. Anybody else? Send the cheap captain and give us anything for getting him a new boat. Stop mentioning the boat. I'll kill you. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so what Darren, do you guys do now? Darren, do you have a pencil or something? Do I have a pencil? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Alright. Here, I hand you the Dean's document. Scratch out Dean the Dean and write Steve the Dean. <laughs> Steve the Dean, he Dean, Dean? He obviously got his name wrong. Hold on. <laughs> Steve the Dean, Dean. Okay. Ah, Perfect. Anyway. Better. I, I assume you guys are heading to the Hunter's Guild. I yeah. assume so. Okay. How would you like close these documents then? Yeah, you know, let's go. It's fine. You can still have access to the uh, documents after. Okay. Yeah, it's in the inventory. Yep. If you open up the thing on the right, you can check them out again. Oh, that's so cool. I know. It's this so, is so it's, cool. This Holy is a good system. Shit. So we're in the Hunter's Guild. Yeah, so as the Hunter's Guild enters your line of sight, you see a half orc giving quite the inspiring, uh, inspiring pep talk to three fledgling hunters. As you approach uh, Ellie, she plants her hand firmly on your shoulder and pulls you to her side and continues her speech. She says, I mean, look at these fine young lads. Do they look like they'd be scared of a little piggy? The fledglings try to get a word in edgewise, but she just kind of dismisses them. Hello, she Emily. Turns, she turns to you and says, what do you want? Uh, I require your signature, madam. Yeah. I want a hug. Well, no, <laughs> not not a hugging we, type. We have Thanks. a message from Steve. I just, Steve? does not ring a bell. Steve the Dean, ring a bell. Dean, Steve. You mean Dean? Yeah, it's yeah, Dean. Dean. Yeah. Okay, he kept cool. He kept she, she holds out her hand, waiting for you to. 
give her the letter. I, I, I hand her the letter. Awesome. So, uh, yeah, she kind of just chuckles at whatever the letter says, and also the fact that you guys changed his name. <laughs> yeah. She's not a big fan of the guy either, so she appreciates the humor. Oh, good. Uh, good friend. So yeah, she explains to you. She says, uh, "I need you to head to the uh, to the hunting grounds to the west of uh, of Deadlock. Okay. Something is scaring away my hunters." I'm leaving. In what sense, Darren? Okay. I'm on my way to the hunting grounds. Okay, good. I was because I, I, you made it very unclear. Like I have to go to the hunting grounds. I'm gone. <laughs> gone. Okay. Anyways, she hands she hands out a net. Uh, whoever wants it can take it. Uh, if you can bring it back alive, okay, whatever okay. it is, there'll be a reward in it for you. Is Either it a piggy? Way... What? Look, you just finished my sentence. <laughs> uh, either way, it needs to be taken care of. My hunters refuse to go back to work while it's still unsafe to go to the hunting grounds. Is it a piggy? I don't know, I haven't seen it with my own eyes. That's why I want you to bring it back alive. But, according to my men, apparently it's half pig, half bear. Whatever. I don't know. Is, Some is, hunters is, are scared is, of a half pig, is there, half bear? Is there any man in that mix? <laughs> no, why do you ask? Just just something I heard once. No. I feel like Al Gore would have told me about that. <gasps> you know him too? Yeah, I he's mean, one of my hunters. <laughs> one spreading the rumor about this weird <laughs> bear pig. You guys, I'm super ethereal. But it appears not to be a rumor because all of my hunters are scared of the hunting grounds now. I need you guys to take care of this. You can bring it back alive. I will reward you. All right. Cool. And then if we do that, will you sign our little document? Sure. <laughs> I don't know do, if I do, do, we, do we need to do that first <laughs> to get you to sign it? I mean... Yeah. It's, yeah. Just, it's just a signature. You, you could sign it now and we could do it. Yeah, or later. I could just not sign it. I mean, look, it's crafty. It's crafty. are you scared of pigs? <laughs> no. I, I look her up and down, and then I shake my head. I thought you guys were supposed to be the best the Guardians Academy had to offer. Right? You should see our boat. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> I need to have that Silent Andrew rage thing just pop up whenever I need it. <sighs> yes, let's go fight Man Bear Pig. Okay, so the three of you head out to the. Head out? Place. I'm already gone. Yes, he's already gone. We been gone for ages. Try and catch up to idiot McElpherson. I, I was just dis- I was distracted wow. by a puppy. And- oh God, we teleported. That was weird. This is fun. <laughs> Cool. Great. So, uh, about a couple hours away from town, uh, or the capital city, I should say. It's more than a town. Uh, you guys uh, come across the main entrance of the hunting grounds forest, but you see ahead of you uh, three orc bandits, just kind of chilling. They haven't noticed you yet. They're like facing away. They're just... Bush-looking things? You have not been noticed yet. They, uh, they're still just kind of chilling there. I assume we're all very good at stealth. I'm not bad, actually. Uh, I want to sneak up to the three of them. What is the what is your plan, Theron? Burning hands. Do we know if these are orcs or not, or we don't know what these are? My plan is burning hands. Yeah, they're orcs. Yeah. Um, because uh, orcs are my uh. Favorite Special enemies. Thing. Yeah, I know Orcish, so maybe I try to listen. As Wind River favorite. licks his lips, <laughs> my favorite. <enemy. laughs> my favorite. Yeah. I, uh, I see if I could listen in on uh, their conversation. Hmm. Okay, uh, how well, far away are you right now? You're still at the the entrance there because you're pretty far. Yeah, so maybe I can move up a bit without being seen. Maybe. Yeah. The well then, yeah. Roll a stealth check. <laughs> Is that close right. enough? <laughs> Can I hide in the bushes over here? With the uh, check? Roll, a, roll a stealth check, please. All right. Wait, I got this. 13 plus 5. Yes. You stealthily creep into the bushes and listen in. 
And uh, you don't understand Orcish. I don't believe you do. Yeah, I do. Do you actually? Yeah. Because, okay. like, uh, because <laughs> they're like my favorite uh, enemy, I understand their language just like automatically. Okay, cool. Uh, yeah, so you just hear them kind of laughing about the the uh, the silly hunters that were scared away by just some little pig. <laughs> Wait, okay. Is a pig? Yeah. <laughs> All right. Well, he's in the bushes. Gary, do you think you can make it to the bushes too, unseen? Uh, I How could, stealthy are you? I could try. All right. I want, I want to make it to the bushes, like over here, though. I don't see what over here is. Mm. Yeah. I don't think that's a good idea. I think it's a great idea. You're gonna have to roll a stealth check. If you're I'm gonna to roll a stealth check. Yeah. Oh shit! Four. Plus two. Four plus two, yeah. Six. Uh, <laughs> the uh, the branches. Just, hmm? Did I just kind of walk over and go, "Hey guys"? <laughs> Might as well have, yeah. Uh, <laughs> as you're trying to sneak past them, the uh, the branches that you're treading on kind of crack, and yeah. all the orcs gathered around the fire are uh, alerted they... to the presence. Cool. Uh, At least Joey's still a. Uh... Joey had... is still fully stealthed. Yeah. I yeah. try and join Joey in the stealth thing. over here. Whenever. Okay. Yeah. Make a stealth check. They they haven't seen you yet. We're just gonna uh, abandon Theron. <laughs> four plus three is seven. Okay, seven. Unfortunately, they do see you, trying to tra uh, trying to crawl into the bushes. <laughs> Damn it! Okay. Yeah. Oh well. So we need to roll oh, for yeah. uh, initiative. So now you need to roll for initiative. Yes. All right. I rolled eleven plus three is uh, wow. fourteen. Maps. Fifteen plus three is eighteen. Math. Ten total. Okay, so it's gonna be Joey up first. He's Joey. It's gonna be Wind River. <laughs> 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 That was really well done. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right, so I'm going to. Dude, are you like Green Arrow? Do you have, like punch arrows and shit? Did you just, like punch that one into the fire? Oh, actually, wait. How close together are these dudes? Uh, they're about five feet away from each other. Like each uh, one, there's a five foot. Okay, so just, I'm gonna, I'm gonna yeah, aim just... for the guy in the middle then, and I want to use a hail of thorns, which is a cantrip, I guess, or but no, it's a spell that I have. Okay, so read the description to me, please. So hail of thorns. Uh, this spell creates a rain of thorns that sprouts from your ranged weapon or ammunition. In addition to the normal effect of the attack, the target of the attack and each creature within five feet of it must make a dexterity saving throw. A creature takes 1d10 piercing damage on a failed save, or half as much on a successful one. Cool. So it's an extra 1d10 to, like, AoE. Okay, so I need to make a saving throw? Sorry, I was writing down information. Three, I believe. Yeah, you need to dexterity saving throw. Dexterity saving throw, thank god. <clears throat> uh, what do I have to beat? Uh, that'd be my spell, whatever. Yeah. Mm, 13. 13. First one dodges. Second one also dodges. Third one does not dodge. Hmm. So uh, what happens? Connects that half damage to the guys who dodge or what? Yeah, half damage to the guys who dodge. And plus the original guy I'm aiming at just does normal arrow damage plus the whatever. And you're aiming at the dude in the middle? Yeah. Okay. So seven. Seven damage to the first guy? That's the hail of my Hail of Thorns does seven damage, so seven to the guy does full, and then the other two, I guess, three or four. Yeah, it rounds oh, down. Oh, okay, right, right, right. It round oh, actually, I think it's always rounded down, yeah. yeah. So, and then the original guy I shoot at, he gets also the aerial. I have to roll for that too. Which is nine. Plus two. Plus wait, what's the plus two for? Oh yeah, right, because it works. works. Eleven. 
11 damage to the guy in the middle? Yeah. Okay. Do you do uh, plus 2 damage because of on the spell as well? I do not know. Plus 2 on the saving throws? I think it's only with normal attacks. I don't know about spells. I I'd say it's the, I'd say if it's against an orc, yeah, that definitely counts. That's what I understand. If it doesn't specify, I would assume so. Okay, well, if you want to pl add two to all the damage, that'd be pretty sick. Okay. I suppose one, since you have to have everything for the other two. Yeah. Okay. Oh. The middle one is dead. Well done, you stealthy bastard. Yeah, yeah. the other two, they're pretty okay. <laughs> pretty okay. Pretty okay. They're pretty okay. How disappointing. And I guess I'm not uh, stealth anymore, eh? <laughs> oh, you're definitely not stealth anymore. No, they, they definitely see you now. Uh, so now, yeah, it was uh, Theron's turn. Oh, it's my turn. Um, I think I'm casting uh, something involving fire. Yeah, I can. Uh, I'm casting fireballs on the one closest to me, as you Which can see on screen. Then. So I'm going to step left, forward right? five feet so I, my sprite can be seen. Uh, the one to to the left of the screen, to the left of the fire. That's it. To the left of the fire. Okay. Yeah. He, he's closest to me. Can you see that? Okay. Yeah. So uh, so attack right? Uh, Firebolt, you have most creature within range, make a ranged spell attack. Yeah, I need to roll for it. Yeah, go for it. Uh, that's 16 plus uh, 5, I think. Yeah, that's 21. Yeah, so that hits. Yeah, which is a 1d10. And I rolled a 10. Nice. Christ. He's dead. Shabam! <laughs> you guys are cleaning up pretty nicely. Hey everybody, it's your Dungeon Master here. I uh, wanted to say a couple of things. First of all, thank you for watching. Thank you for being a fan. Thank you for the love and support. Uh, second of all, sorry about the delay for this episode. It was supposed to come out on Sundays. Um, didn't happen. A lot of technical issues. Not a big deal. Worked through it. It's out now that's what's important hopefully the next one comes out on time on sunday but just so you know there will be a change in schedule in the near future we'll let you know when that happens don't worry thank you everyone for watching remember to like subscribe and comment peace